Uh, welcome back uh, ladies and gentlemen to Frontline News channel wherever you are watching us and if you are meeting us for the, meeting this channel for the first time I am kindly requesting you to subscribe on our YouTube channel and comment for more updates as we analyze them into our YouTube channel. Finally, Ruto finally Ruto suffer a blow on a Gen Z demonstration as international commission of jurist issues the demand of the release of the people who was arrested who was arrested arrested on tuesday and thursday during the demonstration protest in the in nairobi city here the angry youth, the Nairobi city here, behind this one, the angry youth, the angry youth Gen Z had promised to come out in large numbers on, tw on Tuesday to protest against the finance bill that passed in the second reading yesterday in the parliament and again to come to, come to protest against the Evans Kiruti who just lost her life uh, on Thursday during the protest because it has seemed that the, it has been recognized that the police officer injured her private part by beating him, beating him badly in the private. He just died. He, he, he died today while undergoing treatment in the Kenyatta Hospital, and right now her family are demanding for the, are requesting for the, uh, the government to. To do the inspection about the police officer who killed Evans Kiruti, who is just a 20 young year old man who came from Kiambu County. And we, before we continue, I want you to watch this video about the family of Evans Kiratu speak having a press briefing with a citizen people early this evening about the death of their son Evans Kiritu. Ratu, who was unarmed, was rushed to the Kenyatta National Hospital in critical condition. <laughs> Hana Waidanji, his mother, is yet to come to terms with the death of her son. He was one of her two children. She was too overwhelmed to speak. He was hit by a tear gas container on his private path, so he was not able to walk or do anything, and he brought him to Kenyatta National Hospital, where he was admitted, and before we reached here, Yesterday he passed on. Yona Muiri to go to New York. Jana wetu alipigwa na askari na tear gas the private party yake. Sasa wakati tulikuja tulikuwa nataka kujua vile tunaendelea ama kupata haki yetu. Kujua mambo lazima tugeisikiza kutoka kwa hawa wameka mwili. Wakatuambia lazima tukuje huku Monday ndio tufanye postmortem na achukue achukulio fingerprint. In entire of my life, I've never seen a man breathe in pain just like the way Evans was. He kept on uh, crying and literally screaming the whole journey, holding his uh, testicles. I want to say uh, he had uh, the whole of his testicles had completely uh, burst, and um, we took him to the Kenyatta National Hospital. A beautiful picture of a mother and son, the only memories that will remain of a firstborn child who had moved out of their home just a month ago and rented a house along Thika Road in Nairobi. Evans was yet to join any institution of higher learning, but he was training as a plumber. The family saying he was a hard-working young man. And he kept on saying that, I really want to talk to my mom, and please, I love you, mom. And this is very unfortunate. I feel very bad. And uh, please, government, this is a, a wake-up call. This is not a fight that you're supposed to end young people. We are demanding for justice for my nephew. Finally, Kenya Kwanza drum up a support for the finance bill as MPs maintain finance bill aim to bring, to bring development to bring development here in Kenya. Senator Kiriot protest until not intimidated. They court hunt him down. The, sorry, the government hunt him down at the finance bill protesters. In Nairobi, several protesters go into hiding to avoid arrest. 
to avoid the avoid being arrested and being injuries during the protest the ongoing protest that is going on here in here in Nairobi country and other parts of the county like Nairobi Mombasa Kisumu Kakamega Eldoret and uh, Nyeri town Gen Z plan to occupy church countrywide tomorrow when President William Ruto expected to attend the church service in Nyahururu, Nyahururu tomorrow. He will be attending the church there. That's why the Gen Z plan to occupy the church countrywide when President William Ruto will be visiting that place tomorrow to, have, um, to, to, to go there and have mass with the people of Nyahururu place. Evans Kiratu died while undergoing the treatment or at Kenyatta National Hospital. Kiruti death bring to bring to tone number of protesters killed at Masai was shot and killed on Thursday evening when they are when the when people are now leaving the town going to their going to their places, resident places where they always live. And Evans and this Maasai man was just shot at the was shot at the leg where he was bleeding and he there was nobody to give him to give him support when he was shot by a police a known police officer. The international commission the international commission of jurists have issued a statement demanding for the release of the arrest of Kenyans by police officers during the GNZ demonstration against the finance bill against the finance bill that has been going on here in Nairobi here in Nairobi county since Tuesday up to now there are some people that have been arrested there and have not yet been released that have not yet been released they went to ahead to say that they arrest were against the human rights and uh, according to article 37 that showed according to the constitution 